Now let's talk for a moment about the connections for field view to a Generation 1 2020 and how those should be made so that the iPad will charge. You can see I can identify a Generation 1 2020 by the fact that I have two USB ports on the side of the display, no USB ports on the back. I also have a toggle switch to turn it on and off. So with the Generation 1 2020, you will need the Field View module. That Field View module has a cable with a Y that connects to the back of the display or to the cab control module harness if you have a cab control module. There is a cord from that harness that plugs into the side of the 2020 display, a USB cord there. And then your USB cord, charging cord that comes with the iPad will go from the back of the field view module to the iPad. Here you can see my one times per second light on the module so that I can see that it is operating correctly. And if I turn my 2020 around, we'll see on the page here for diagnose and FVM. So FVM button here. And I'm connected, yes. Authenticated, yes. Field view session currently says no. So if I turn my iPad around for you, if I don't have a field view session, the best thing would be to unplug the cord and then reconnect the cord and see if that solves the issue for me. Most of the time it will. I see now the charging indicator up here. I can select yes, it's my 2020 to keep the two synced. And now I have FV session yes here on my 2020. If that did not work for you, hard rebooting the iPad is a good next step. To... So if I'm still struggling with the connection of my 2020 with my Kalimet field view, my next step would be to do what's a, called a hard reboot of the iPad. Close the Climate field view cab app by pressing the home button. From the home screen then, press the home button here and the power button located here on my iPad, but maybe on the side on yours, at the exact same time until the iPad begins to reboot. At that point, you can let go of those buttons, and you should see the Apple icon come on the screen, indicating that it's rebooting. After that, you can disconnect and reconnect the charging cord to the iPad, and it should connect just fine with your 2020 seed sense. If you're still having problems, contact your Precision Planning Premier Dealer, Climate Dealer, or Precision Planning Product Support for Climate Support. Thank you for watching this video.